Hello again, this is Captain John with another one of my video tips of the week. There will be times when you need to convert a true course to a magnetic course. It's best not to go by calculations alone. Use a diagram to confirm your figures. Today I'm going to show you how to do this fast and easy. The difference between a true course and magnetic course will be the variation at your location. Find your variation with the closest compass rows or use an isogonic line. Isogonic lines are dashed or solid lines that span the chart you will find the variation written somewhere along the line. On this chart of the Gulf of Mexico, you can see that our compass rose shows only true direction. We look for an isogonic line closest to our location. This isogonic line shows two degrees west. Now let's draw a compass diagram to find the magnetic course to steer. Your true sailing course will be 150 degrees. Draw a line straight up as shown by the blue line and label this line TN, which stands for true north. Draw another line to represent your sailing course. Draw an arrow from the TN line to the sailing course. Label this TC for true course. You can see this makes an approximate angle of 150 degrees true, which will be our true sailing course. Now let's find the compass course to steer. Draw the variation from the true north line in the appropriate direction. Here our variation will be to the west. We can exaggerate this angle to make things crystal clear. Next we draw a line to represent the direction of the magnetic north pole from the center of the diagram and extend the line so that it just touches the arrowhead of the variation angle. The red line in the diagram now shows the direction of magnetic north. Label this magnetic north line MN as shown. Draw an arrow from the MN line to our sailing course line. Now we can compare the magnetic course to the true course. You can see right away that the magnetic course is greater than the true course. This means we need to add our variation of 2 degrees west. The course to steer will be 152 degrees magnetic. Use these easy sailing navigation tips to help keep your small sailboat and sailing crew safe and sound on the waters of the world. This is Captain John, and this has been another one of my video tips of the week. Find more sailing tips and techniques on www.skippertips.com.